It is painful to go over the details again and again, but Shenzhou wants to keep telling her story so that more women in China feel able to speak out. The 28-year-old became the face of China's Me Too movement when she accused a prominent television anchor of sexual assault. Her claims went viral, and her case was one of very few to reach court. It was dismissed in September due to a lack of evidence, but she has launched an appeal listing items which the police failed to present. We met Shenzhou as the Communist Party adopted a historical resolution cementing the power of President Xi and his increasingly authoritarian society. This week's plenum was almost overshadowed by sex abuse allegations. Chinese tennis player Peng Ju Ai claims former Vice Premier Zhang Gaoli sexually abused her over several years. It is the first time Me Too allegations have reached the highest level of government. Her post was deleted by state censors in less than 30 minutes. In a very uh, men dominant society, and the, the men they got the power to do things, yeah, like gender-based violence, domestic violence, it's, a, it's still a very severe issue in China. Ting Ting has been campaigning for women's rights for almost a decade. She has been detained, threatened, and her phone activity is monitored. Despite that, she believes progress is being made. Not only the Me Too movement, but uh, the, for the whole women movement or feminism movement is going to be very alive in the future. The Me Too movement has a growing voice in China. It just has trouble being heard. Debbie Edward, News at 10, Beijing.